This is the Zercher Good Morning Offset Loaded. I'm gonna show you the movement first, and then we'll talk through why it's so important and how to set it up. So I'm gonna get a barbell here. I have uneven weights on each side. This is a 10 pound plate. This is a 25 pound plate in a normal barbell. When I get set up here on the barbell, the zercher position means I'm gonna have the bar in the crook of my elbows here and I'm gonna pull it tight to my chest and pull my shoulders back. Now when I go pick up this bar, remember it's unbalanced load. So the bar is gonna to try to lean me this way. I'm gonna fight that the whole time from the time I pick it up. <laughs> I'm gonna come out, get set up with my feet about hip width apart, toes pointed straight. I'm gonna unlock my knees. And from here, I'm just gonna bend at the hips like I would for a normal good morning or RDL, keeping the bar nice and tight to my body. I'm reaching my hips back. I'm gonna stand up tall, squeeze my glutes and drive my belt buckle forward towards the camera. I'm gonna do another rep here. Notice I'm using my breathing. I'm inhaling on the way down. <sighs> Exhaling on the way up. Couple things to think about here. Number one, good to have a rack to pick the bar up and out of. But in this Zercher Good Morning, we're really building strength in the low back, the glutes and the hamstrings. So that's a great thing for us to do because we need to be able to build up strength in the posterior side of my body to protect my low back. And strength back here is what creates movement forward. So that's what's gonna make us sprint faster, run longer, all of a jump higher, all that kind of stuff. That, that's what translates into human movement. But as we do it with the Zercher position, we're also building good core strength, shoulder stability, because I have to fight against that load that's trying to pull me forward and actually trying to even pull my spine out of position. So I'm gonna build a lot more strength in that Zercher position. Also really good for anything that I have to do where I have to carry something heavy because I'm building strength in my arms, carrying this heavy load close to my body. And then the last thing we're doing here is we have an unconventional loading method. A lot of times we get really, really good at picking up even weights on a barbell or dumbbells, but in life, that's not typically how it works. When I go to pick something up, often, I'm in an unbalanced position or the load is unbalanced from picking it up on the side of my body. So what we're doing here is we're actually training my body to be able to stabilize and control different forces. So I've got an unbalanced load and I'm trying to keep my body straight. So the whole time the load is trying to pull me over here to the left. So I'm going to fight against that working this whole right side of my body to keep this locked down. And I'm going to go through my normal Zercher good morning. So what I would do here, because this is a strength movement, I would typically program this for somewhere between eight to 12 reps. Nice, slow, controlled tempo like you saw me doing. Slow and controlled, little pause at the bottom and then driving my hips through to stand up tall at the top. And then one really important thing is I wanna make sure I switch sides. So I don't wanna only load my left side heavier. So I can do that in a couple ways. If I'm doing an even number of sets, I can do the first set with the weight on my left side and then switch on the second set. Typically what I do is I'll cut the reps in half. So if I'm doing 12 reps, I'll do six of them with the heavier weight on the left side, then I'll switch and I'll do the other six with the weight on the other side. So that is the Zercher Good Morning with an offset load.